Hey Fire Signs, your host Ian Sagittarius. In today's reading, we're going to take a look and see what messages are coming up for you at this particular point in time. It's going to be a general reading, so please keep mindful. If you're after a personal reading, feel free to reach out and inquire. Email is listed below. The Queen of Swords is the overall energy that um, crowns the reading here. And this is an energy where I feel like you're getting, um, I just feel like your communication skills are going to be especially effective. And I'm also seeing that there's a lot of mental clarity for you. The Queen of Swords is also about truth. And so she's inspiring for you to connect to your inner truth. Um, there is something here that... There's a truth or um, an inner knowing that resides within you, uh, but you have to connect with it. I also feel like uh, Queen of Swords energy is... I feel like she's highlighting that there's going to be an important conversation an important conversation over the next couple of weeks or the next month or so that is going to reveal something or that is going to work something out that is going to move something forward so an important conversation that's going to take place um, It's a conversation that may be a little bit difficult and it's a conversation that maybe you've been uh, putting off but once you have this conversation there's a truth that's going to be spoken or you're encouraged to speak your truth here um, there's something that someone might say which may surprise you which may take you back a, a bit but um, all in all I feel like this conversation is really important as it's going to um, either clear things up between you and someone or clear some things up for you um, it could also move things forward for you in a very big way so in a very important conversation um, I feel like the energies are really shifting towards your emotions here this month and I think you're really focusing on matters of the heart and especially healing um, I feel like with the ace of cups this is the flow of energy and I think that there is like right now you're taking a moment or you're taking some time to identify with your feelings especially any lingering feelings or any feelings that have been suppressed and bottled up um, and I feel like this is like an outpour or this is like a release and this is a you know letting go of feelings that have been stored or energies that have been stored so yeah I feel like you're really connecting with your emotions um, Um, I also feel like there's something here that there's something here that's going to cause a lot of emotions for you to come up to the surface something here that I feel like is going to be um, either an encounter an, inv a, an event or a meeting of some sort or maybe it's this conversation that we spoke about but something here I feel like is bringing up a lot of emotions for you and it feels very emotional. It may leave you very emotional. It may leave you in tears. I'm also seeing that there's some surprising news that is coming in for you. Something that might even shock you or something that you're going to be really excited to share. Some of you I feel like are pursuing a new... You're pursuing some sort of new goal or a new career path altogether. I'm also seeing that 
your intuition is really heightened, your intuition, your awareness, and this inner knowing. I feel like for those of you that are seeking the answers to something, you're seeking it outside of you, but the answers are within you. I also feel like you're going to be calling out any people or any persons that don't respect your boundaries. And I feel like there's an uncomfortable power dynamic in some sort of relationship or connection or a friendship. And I think that you're going to call this person out. There is something new that is beginning for you. And I feel like this is going to build up a lot of stability. And I think it's going to um, bring you a lot of happiness and a lot of joy into your life. Over the next couple of weeks, I feel like you're going to be a lot busier than usual. And I think you may be starting... You may be starting something new or you might be connecting with um, someone new or even someone from the past. Someone who has fallen off the radar uh, will come back here. Um, make sure that you address any emotions or any frustrations and that you don't bottle anything up. Okay, so address it instead of bottling up because there is this strong energy of suppressing or bottling up emotions um, your dreams could be especially vivid and uh, very meaningful around this time so pay close attention to the symbols or the reoccurring um, dreams that you might be having um, or any like reoccurring synchronicities i feel like there is like your subconscious is trying to communicate something to you something that you otherwise maybe would not want to face so your subconscious is doing all of this communicating through the form of dreams or maybe even synchronicities and it's something once again it is something that's inside of you something that you already know but maybe you don't want to face so you're going to be receiving a lot of dreams or a lot of signs and synchronicities reoccurring messages that will keep happening and keep occurring again and again until you sort of pick up on their message You might also hear from someone or you may be inspired to message someone like you'll have a dream about this person and you'll be inspired to connect with them or to reach out and message them could be a romantic um, interest or it could be like a, a family member or a friend or like a family member or um, a connecting energy he might have a dream about you and that might inspire for them to reach out and connect with you there is something surprising happening for you here and I think that for those of you that are creatively or artistically inclined, I do think your creative juices are flowing. I feel like you're very, feeling very inspired and feeling very motivated. Um, definitely take advantage of this energy because I think that you could potentially come up with something that might even surprise you. I feel like your ideas um, are really flowing. In fact, they're overflowing. So make sure you do um, write and jot everything down, especially like with the high priestess in the middle here. I feel like you've got some really good ideas that are kind of like locked and stored in your subconscious. Um, and they're kind of making their way out um, through dreams or through reoccurring symbols or synchronicities. You're going to be celebrating something very um, important and something very um, something very significant, something very important, something very joyous. It feels like you could be buying a home, um, moving into a new home. You could be visiting family or friends. Um, family and friends could be visiting you. You could also be connecting or reconnecting with someone. This is an energy of like coming home or homecoming or someone feels like home to you or buying your own home moving into your own home um, you could be redecorating as well um, redecorating refurbishing your own home renovating but this i feel like this is taking place around your home space you could be moving homes okay moving homes moving into a new home or Something here is taking place in your home. I don't know, maybe if you've, you've agreed to host something uh, special coming up, an upcoming event. Um, but this is going to be very, this is very significant for you. And it's going to be very important. The emperor here, I feel like he's... I 
I feel like he's telling you that you're going to be stepping into a role where I feel like there's more authority or you might even have more like more responsibility at this job you could also be negotiating a raise or trying to negotiate a promotion and I feel like around this time you're feeling very productive you're going to be coming up with a new goal like a safe new like financial or a savings goal or just a new goal for what you want to do around uh, the workspace I feel like you're really taking the time to reflect what work is really meaningful to you and as a result some of you could potentially be changing jobs you might be um, yeah you might be changing uh, roles some of you could potentially connect with a VIP um, or someone in your social circle connects you to a VIP this is a very exciting opportunity and th their energy is exception like it's exceptionally great for collaborating and brainstorming and just sort of you know hanging out they're a very relaxed supportive individual um, I feel like you are processing some deeper and some heavier emotions this month I do think that you're giving yourself the time and the space to move these bottled up or stored up emotions or energies and so you could potentially be trying to process um, a lot of like um, memories or a lot of emotions that could you know bring up um, a lot of memories or could bring up a lot of emotions I'm also seeing that you're going to be spending some time with people who challenge you um, or you're going to be spending time doing something that challenges you so maybe that's learning a new hobby or a new skill or you're spending time with people who challenge you but in a good way like people who uh, maybe motivate you or people who have you know who you can debate with um, or maybe you know someone whom you can have like taboo conversations with or discuss your fears with this person you're definitely spending more time in and around the home and with your family and with friends and I just think right now is a really good time for you to um, yeah for you to spend more time with family with friends and be productive but I also feel like you're doing thing like a lot more of the things that you enjoy there's definitely a shift in your mindset from what I can see I feel like you're experiencing a new shift in your mindset about an ID or a project that you had or about um, a, like plans that you've had and some of you I feel like you're trying to negotiate contracts or you're trying to it's like you're tr trying to pitch something to someone um, if that's the case there's definitely a breakthrough moment so there's some sort of breakthrough moment when it comes to career negotiations or you trying to sign contracts or trying to negotiate contracts or trying to pitch something to someone all right guys and i'm going to leave it there thank you for your time energy and attention please show your support by subscribing to the channel if you haven't already bye for now